Hello and welcome to a city known for its innovation and technology. We're in Mainz, the capital of Rheinland-Pfalz. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's the Netherlands against Italy. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here's the starting 11 for the Netherlands. Jasper Sillesen is the goalkeeper. Virgil van Dijk plays with Matthijs de Ligt in central defence. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Jorginho Wijnaldum in central midfield. And in attack for this match, it's Memphis Depay. And the Italy starting 11. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Francesco Acerbi plays with Rafael Toloi in central defence. Marco Verratti starts alongside Nicolo Barella in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And so the match is underway. Domenico Berardi. Barella has it. A very good tackle. The pie. Well, the attack looks promising. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. Well, he has players waiting at the back post. Oh, but claimed by the goalkeeper. Well, he can be very unpredictable and, let's face it, devastating out there on the pitch. Memphis Depay. Stewart, what might we see from him in this match? I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders. He's got that ability to run with the ball into open space. He can pick out a pass. He can wriggle out of tight situations. He's the most creative player on the field today. Wijnaldum! Oh, great block. Verratti Pellegrini Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay Jorginho Wijnaldum Very quick thinking there Pellegrini Leonardo Spinazzola. Berardi has it. Just the challenge that was required. Gakpo. Depay. Good technique displayed. Can't miss, surely. High echelon goalkeeping there. A 
Well, they're going for the short one. De Jong. Van Dijk. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. And foul it is then. Cleared away comprehensively. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. Well, some referees might have elected to hand out the yellow card, but no booking on this occasion. Well, not quite the header he had in mind, and the goalkeeper gobbling that one up. Well, those stats tell you everything. A tight and cagey game without enough goal mouth action. Both teams need to get more players forward if they're to pose a real threat. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Jorginho. Jorginho and intercepted it Steven Berghaus Barella has it Domenico Berardi oh the threat is there good defending in the end and danger averted for now and so the first half has come to an end here in rheinland pfalz Well, just reflecting on Memphis Depay in the first half, Stuart, he wasn't really able to take the game by the scruff of the neck in the manner that we associate with him. Well, he struggled to have any real impact on the game. I think if they are to kick on in the second half, it's key that he sees a bit more of the ball. And hopefully with that, he can start to put that back line under a bit more pressure. And the match is underway. Good technique displayed. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Determined defending. Well, he could really get at the opposition. And let's give credit to the defending. The pie. Can he finish? Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. So underway again here, one nil the score. That's really good and effective physical play. Barella. Verratti now. And tremendous individual skill. Oh, a lovely ball. And denied by the post. Oh, there it is. A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted merely minutes.
Well, just look at this. He's so bright in the box. He's first to the ball and then a decent finish. It's a good bit of play. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. So a half an hour remaining. Trying to really get at the opposition here. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And showing fine vision. Verratti. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here's the replay, and it has been coming. They've played some great football in this game, and they fully deserve this goal. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Cutting infield here. Now just the tackle that was needed. Into the final 20 minutes. Moving forward effectively. Depay. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Pellegrini. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Gakpo. Depay. Depay. It's with Daron. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Verratti. Now, what can they produce on the flank? Chance to cross. Oh, good play, this. Perfectly fair tackle, and it will be a corner. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. And taken short. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Okay. It's with Cope Mainers. Ake has it. Virgil van Dijk. Now with De Jong. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. This could be it. And it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. Well, as you can see, what an excellent backfield this is to set up the goal. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. And the final whistle. Defeat here for the Netherlands. 
Stewart, your assessment as regards their performance? Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player. And so the battle commences. Good technique displayed. Can't miss, surely!